holding on to this storm for quite some time though. Now into northern Grayson County. It was in Bryan and Marshall counties earlier this afternoon. Starting to see signs of that blue sky moving on through here. Currently out of our Sherman Chevrolet Cadillac Tower Cam. Storm still generally overhead down to 59 degrees because of that rain cooled air. Here is radar. We've had that storm over Lake Texoma since earlier today. Drifting off to the south. Sherman also going to be picking up some rain storms in Lamar County starting to dissipate and we also have storms along the Red River here for the remainder of this uh, late afternoon early evening time frame. Lightning strikes along the Red River to the east and northeast side of Denison and then some rain starting to get closer and closer towards Sherman proper farther off to the east. That storm that was near Paris has since kind of moved out of here. Low and severe weather risk for the rest of today, mainly for hail and wind. That's going to go through about 8 o'clock. After that, we're going to lose a lot of that energy from daytime heating. Threats across the board are low. Quarter size hail and 60 mile per hour winds. And so far, storms have remained sub severe. Data not bringing in a whole lot of activity for the remainder of this evening outside of that main storm in Grayson County. Most of Wednesday is quiet, but then we head into Wednesday overnight in early Thursday morning. We're going to have storms approaching from the southwest that move off to the north and the northeast overnight Wednesday and early Thursday morning with more storms possible out the door Thursday. If you're headed to school to work or wherever else, rain is going to be in your future. That lasts through mid to late morning. We get a little bit of a lull by the afternoon before additional storms build in late Thursday. Severe weather possible both Wednesday overnight into Thursday as well as Friday with more rain along a cold front that's going to be arriving late this week. That severe weather risk for Wednesday overnight early Thursday, mainly our Texas counties right now. Then we go into Thursday. Everyone could see thunderstorm chances with some stronger storms expected from Ardmore to Gainesville and over towards Sherman and Denison, mainly with damaging winds and some hail up to at least quarter size. Rainfall totals could reach up to an inch by the end of this week and temperatures slowly falling. We're in the 70s Wednesday, Thursday and Friday with 50s by Saturday afternoon. We'll be in the 40s and 50s. 50s starting off tomorrow morning by the afternoon, low to mid 70s, and then a look at that seven day forecast sponsored by KM Roofing and Construction. We've got sunshine to end the weekend, heading into early next week. Low is going to be in the 30s Sunday and Monday mornings, upper 60s by Monday afternoon, and low 70s heading into next Tuesday. We also spring forward an hour by this weekend, guys.